In this video we're going to be looking at uh, the algorithm behind addition. Um, so when you're adding two numbers of multiple digits, what exactly are we doing? Um, the process is very mechanical basically. It's just to add the first digit of the first number to the first digit of the second number. Um, have your sum here and your carry right here and keep on doing this process until you reach the end. So we're going to Describe that in words and an pseudocode basically, and uh, that pseudocode will allow us to implement it in a computer. So uh, the the algorithm goes as follows: First, we're going to be assuming that we're storing our two numbers in two arrays, A and B, and uh, we're going to be starting by creating a variable called carry, which will store a carry for every single sum. And at the beginning, we're going to assign it the value zero. And then we're going to loop through all the variables, uh, all the uh, all the digits of uh, the numbers. So we're going to be going from i is equal to zero. So from the single, from the first index zero to um, to the last one. So from i equal to zero to i is equal to n minus one, where n is basically the number of digits. So in this case, the number of digits is four, right? So we're going from zero to three. Zero, one, two, three and this is what we're going to be doing. We're going to be storing the result, so this is going to be a result here, in an array called R. So RI, so if we're concerned with the first column here, uh, I will be equal to zero. So we're going to be computing the sum for this particular digit here of the array R is going to be equal to that digit plus that digit plus the carry. So AI where i is equal to zero in this case, plus bi plus the carry, okay? And we're going to be modding it with 10 because we're just going to take, we're going to divide it by 10 basically and keep the um, the remainder here. So suppose we had 9 here and 9 here. We're going to add 9 plus 9, we're going to get 18. We're going to be dividing that by 10, but this will only keep the remainder. So we're just going to keep the 8 here. And then we're going to be actually dividing that same result here by 10. Uh, but this time, this division is integer div division, so it's just going to keep the 1 here. So this one is going to be stored as our next carry. So it's going to be taken all the way here. It's going to become our new carry. So our first carry was 0. Second carry is going to be 1. And um, this 8 is obtained by performing this division and keeping the remainder using the mo modulo sign, the modulo operator. Um, and this, we're going to keep on doing this for every single column here. And we're going to be storing our results in the R array. And so we end our for loop. And finally, at the end, we're just going to store um, the very last carry. So if there's anything that overflows after this last addition here, the last column, then we're just going to store it um, in the last in n, in, in index n. So right here for r. So the carry will just going to is just going to be stored in the last index of the r array. So assuming that actually r could extend uh, for more than four digits, and this is basically our algorithm.